Actually, we worked on our power play breakout and in zone a little bit, so we did. Uh, we scored, I think, on our first power play, and it's something we were working on. So we got work on that, a little bit on the PK. Um, but uh, you know, I think we won the special penalty. Score on a power play at the end, yeah, we won the second half. But that's the turnover. That's uh, that's a tough one to give up. But uh, I thought overall, you know, we killed a five on three almost full two minutes. That's one thing we didn't work on. So uh, our goalie held us under for that. Yeah, what do you think? I mean. Um Pio and, and John being paired together, what was kind of thought process behind that? And um, how much you how they play, especially not having had like a development camp or anything like that, kind of just coming in for the first time? Uh, putting them together, I mean, you know, righty lefty, obviously you want the righty lefty, they're both big guys, great sticks. I think I, I think the, both are going to be outstanding NHL defensemen. They you know, just need a little maturity and uh, development, but they're really good players. So I, I like their game. Uh, both those guys together. I thought they played really well. Marino went end to end once. I mean, did that surprise you at all? I didn't. Yeah, I was, that necessarily was in his repertoire. Yeah, I thought it was a nice play. So you know, when we were backing him up, but I thought it was a real nice play, and uh, you know, he showed some offense, which is great. But uh, he showed a lot of poise, great stick, long. Um, really impressed with his game. I jumped out at you, uh, maybe tonight or today. Geez, there was a lot of guys, really, to be honest with you. I, I, I talked about them. Addison, I thought he had a real good game. I think he had a couple assists early on. It was a plus player. Um, did well in power play. We talked about P.O. We talked about Marino. Um, I thought uh, uh, Almari had a good, all four of those D had a real good game. They're good players. And, um, our goalie played well. I mean, he played really well. So there's a lot of guys that played well, I thought. That was a good game overall. I mean, for the uh, first game of uh, uh, rookie camp, Pretty exciting hockey end to end and a lot of good plays. You're familiar with York before he scored the game winner tonight? Yeah, that was a beauty, obviously. Uh, you know, played against him when he was in Providence and that, so it's a heck of a goal. I mean, he, he uh, obviously deserved the goal and uh, we should do better, but sometimes you got to tip your hat and the guy makes a nice play. Uh, the cross checking penalty you took when you were down the man, is that something like? something you don't want to see happen. Well, it seemed like an unnecessary penalty. Yeah, it is, but you know what, he's competing too, so I don't want to take away somebody that's competing and working hard. You know, is it unnecessary? Yeah, it probably was, but uh, I hate to knock somebody that uh, is competing hard and maybe just got a little overzealous. You know? The older experienced guys who had pro under their belt, all about the letters, Militech, uh, Angelo, and Lafferty, maybe you expect that from them, but how do you see those older, more experienced players sort of uh, interact in the locker room, especially when you give them the responsibility of a captaincy? Well, one of the things I always talk about when you are the captain, it's not just, you know, C and A is for cool. You know, I'm the cool <laughs> guy, I'm the best player. It's, it's a lot of work. You know, we were on the bus and a couple guys weren't on the bus yet, so they got to make sure that they either call them or you know make sure somebody gets a hold of them. And there's a lot of things that go into it. So um, they, they've showed the leadership. I didn't pick them until this morning. I watched yesterday and see who took the leadership, and those three guys took it. Thank you. Cool. Thanks, Thank you.